Let's see, how can I be the worst possible version of myself? I mean, I've got a few ideas. As a preacher, I can always be convinced that I'm right. I can stand behind my pulpit, plug my ears, and lay it on thick, tell you what you should think, what you should believe, prove to you that I'm right. I will inform you of the truth. But I can still make it worse. Because as a prosecutor, I can prove that not only am I right, but also you're wrong. I'll tear your ideas to shreds, bludgeon you with the evidence. How dare you have an idea or an opinion that's contrary to mine? You will submit. You will tap out. You will admit that you are wrong. But I can still be more terrible because I have one more trick up my sleeve. As a politician, I'll also win your approval. I'll get you to love me. I'll show you that I'm the smartest guy in the room. Also the funniest. Probably the best looking too. Certainly the most talented. And as the worst version of myself, I'll go back and forth between preacher, prosecutor, and politician as many times as necessary to make sure I never have to do one specific thing. There is one very important thing that I must never do if I'm going to continue to be the worst possible me I can be. I must never rethink my opinions. I must never humble myself and consider that I don't know all the answers. I can't ever listen to you and think about your ideas or your perspective. And I certainly should never let my guard down and stop trying to get my validation from your acceptance and adoration. Can you even imagine what would happen if I stopped trying to be right, stopped trying to prove you wrong, and found my identity in something more than the approval of other people? I don't even want to think about it.